What is going on guys? My name is Andre Guetta and today I will show you how to upgrade your HDD into SSD. This laptop is very slow, it's old. I think it's 5 years old. So we'll be upgrading its HDD to this. Okay, so we bought a brand new Kingston 1TB SSD NVMe and we will be duplicating this I think or not. I think so. So we'll see. We will go to our cousin's place so yeah that's all we need let's go oh firstly we need to unscrew its screws so that we can open it and then we can disassemble the parts and then we can install the ssd then later we will install the windows so that's the summary of this video if you want to watch it all thank you so much but you can skip ahead if you want to sometimes you just need a guitar pick to open it you know so yeah i think it's open now we can now disassemble the components. So I don't know any of this, but I think you just need to pull the three cords that connecting the motherboard to the keyboard, I think. After that, you can now remove the keyboard. So yeah. Then we can now remove this plastic out of the way. So we can unscrew those tiny little screws that you can see. So this is the satisfying part. Look, look, look. We will now proceed to remove the wires that are connecting to the motherboard. This one, and then this one for the battery. And okay, we will. We can now proceed to remove the screws. But the bang, but the boom, but the bang, but the boom. That's the Wi-Fi. That's the main screw which is quite larger than the others. That's the HDD. That's I don't know but there's two cords so yeah that's that's it. You can now remove the motherboard. A little commercial for you. Looking at my sweaty cousin. <laughs> Thank you for your effort sir. Last thing that we need to remove is the battery as you can see. You need to pull this so that you can remove the motherboard like that. Oh, I forgot about this part. You need to remove the AC. What do you call it? The port where you plug in your charger. I don't know what you call it, but it's sticking in the case. So. <laughs> so yeah this is the most exciting part which is the installation of the ssd so in some cases you don't need to actually remove the motherboard from it but in this case we need to remove it since the ssd slot is in the back of the motherboard so so yeah in this part we will just clean the other components of the laptop since it's five years i never opened it ever since okay so in this part we just need to put back what we removed so yeah that's basically it After doing all that, we can now boot the laptop. First, we will boot it up at its BIOS and then we will install the Windows using a flash drive that has Windows in it. At this point, we just need to hope that the SSD will be readable by the Windows. Ito. Ayo, <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Dapat mag 70% pataas. Pag 70% pataas, goods na yan. Ano yung dire trade yan? Tutuloy yan. Yo, thank you, sir. <clears throat> That pala pinapromote ko yung ano mo, sir, no? Service mo. So, yeah. That's how you install Windows. Um, I will not show how you activate it since I think it's quite illegal. <laughs> so, yeah. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Do you want another thing? So, I will show now how fast this can oh, boot. Binaksa, ha? Oh, bilis, ha? Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Tapos, ayan na, bukas na. Yan, yeah, ang bilis ah. Sabi ni Sarah, ano daw, inom daw tayong tatlo. Sige. Ngayon na? Hindi ngayon. <laughs> Patay ko na ha. Kaya lang, mag-Windows update ka daw muna. Ikaw muna, kailan ko ng sinisakay. Ikaw na. Ikaw na. <laughs> Tinamad ka pa eh. <laughs> so yeah, that's how you upgrade an HDD into SSD. I hope you enjoyed this video. Kindly leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you on another video. If you have any questions, kindly leave a comment down below so I can assist you. And yeah, that's that's it. My name is Andre Guetta, and I have many content out on my channel. You can check it out if you want. I make covers, build PC, review a camera. I don't know. I I do everything. But maybe that's why I don't have any subs since the algorithm is kind of messed up. But yeah, if you check it out, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And yeah, that's it for me for today. Bye.